Hello and welcome to week 12 of 100 Days of Anthropology Stories. This is where I take an image from an anthropology catalog, create an art piece around it, and then write a short story. You can follow along on Instagram at Robin Marie. So I'd like to go through my week 12 projects with you and just tell you a little bit about them. Um, week 12 starts with day 78 and this one is a tag. Kept this one relatively simple. Uh, did some layering with some random papers and the image here is on the corner and it's just of a little bit, it's a wall here with a bed, uh, a bed headboard and a pillow. And then I took a piece of my art pop card, trimmed it out, and then punched a hole in it and adhered it to the tag hole. So this one's pretty simple. That's day 78. Day 79 is also a tag. Um, I covered it with book paper and then I lightly painted it with white paint. I had some random scraps here of some stencils that I had just uh, uh, gotten the ink off of and I just had some ink on the paper. That actually coordinated really well with this uh, image here. And this was done with packing tape and then I just rubbed the backing off after I soaked it in water. So this is a kitchen table set with some fruits and um, I thought it coordinated nicely with the uh, this other paper that I created and made copies of for my own work. And everything was just layered on the tag and stitched on in various places and then I added some sari ribbon to finish it off. And that was day 79. Day 80 is actually several pieces of random papers. One is an art pop card. And again, I did the image on packing tape and I adhered it to this little area here on the art pop card. I trimmed out some other pieces of some various papers. This is an, just a random piece that I had collaged and was in my scraps. And this one here too had some stenciling on it. So there's one, two, three, four. <laughs> there's four elements to this one alone. Just random scraps added to the art pop card. All right, so that's day 80. And day 90 is, this is the image from the catalog. It's a plate and I love the flowers on it. I enhanced them a little with some pencil and pen. And the paper is just some scrap of watercolor paper that I had cleaned my brushes on. So I just folded it, created just this little op you know, opening. I had this scrap here and I folded it over and stitched it on. And really this one was pretty simple. I just added a little bit more paint and some more doodles to it and called it finished. So that one is day 81. Day 82 is a little more complicated. I actually had this in my stash. Um, it's an anthropology envelope and these are the envelopes that they used to send your receipts in when you order something by mail. It's a little string and button envelope. And so what I did is I I covered a tag with some of my own uh, collage paper and I glued it onto the front of the envelope. So here's what the back of the envelope looks like. And I had already stitched on this scrapbook paper and I just added some stamped images here and another piece, this is from the catalog here, and um, some more of my torn uh, collage paper from my own, my own collection. So this has kind of got a multiple has multiple components. You have the tag, you have the envelope, and then on the back you also have this uh, scrapbook paper and of course there's the space in here as well. So there's a lot going on on this one. All right, that is day 82. And day 83 is super simple. It's a tag. I didn't uh, punch the hole in the top of this one. I just left it. I liked the way this looked. And I layered various collage papers onto it. This is the image from the catalog. And then I had this little scrap. It was just a little stitched piece. Uh, you can see it's stitched on one end and I just folded it and stapled it on there. And I like how that orange there carries over some of this color in there. All right, so that's day 83. And lastly, day 84. Now day 84 starts out as one of those, um, it's a coin envelope. This coin envelope um, I had used when I was working with my jelly plate and it just had some random ink on it. So I saved it and it has some acrylic on it. So I liked it and the color on the front had this um, kind of a teal light blue and it matched um, the collage that I created here. These are my own papers 
And then I uh, cut out and added this little image here of a plate and some, um, looks like some herbs or something um, from the anthropology catalog. I stitched a little here and then I stitched um, just some scrap watercolor paper onto the flap. Um, that really just made it stronger, but I also like the way it looks on the side as well. Okay, so that's uh, that's day 84. And yes, you can also, you're probably wondering, you can put things in there as well. So that's day 84. All right, so thank you for joining me for the um, week 12 uh, show and tell and recap. Um, I thank you for all your comments and I appreciate your questions. And if you have any, just let me know. I uh, hope you enjoyed following along and until next time, bye-bye.